Hey Mark, I got a question. Can we please get our PlayStation back? No, Sharky, you and Jack are not getting your PlayStation back. But we're bored. Yeah, we have nothing to do right now. They just go hang out with your friends at the park or something. They're not home right now. Yeah, they're off doing something else. They're with their families. And besides, Junior said that his friends are not coming over today. Then, I'm not sure do whatever the hell, but do anything but play on that damn PlayStation. Besides, y'all need to go outside and get some fresh air. We get fresh air every day. They go get some fresh air, like right now. We don't want to do it without our friends. Yeah, it gets so boring. Besides, what are we even going to do outside? Why are you guys asking me? Make up your own imagination because apparently y'all have the biggest imagination. Like, this is coming from the same two boys who shitted in the sink last week. Yeah, it was pretty funny. Yeah. Sharky, there was nothing funny about you shitting in the sink. Chef, we really had to clean that up. Why did you not get Sarah to do it? I mean, she's a girl. She gets used to cleaning up stuff. No. Sharky, how are you just going to do your own mom like that? I'm just speaking facts. Sharky, how dare you go and respect, disrespect a woman like that? Damn. Can I not tell truths around here? Looks like I'm going to have to start telling lies for now on. Sharky, don't disrespect your mother like that. And y'all guys are double grounded for disrespecting your mother. This is stupid as hell. We're going to do something else. Alright, fine. Beg, go do something else. I'm sorry you had to go through that, sweetie. I know, but the, the kids are just a little bit mad. Are you really sure you had to take away their PlayStation? They shitted in the sink. Yeah, that's a good point. Since we can't do anything, Sharky, what are you going to do now? I'm not sure, Jeffrey. I guess we're just going to have to come up with something. What the hell? So, I heard y'all kids were looking for something to do. Yeah, we're bored. Yeah, we're bored out of our minds. We're enticingly looking for something to do. Well, I have the good stuff right here. A, a, a puppet? Really? You're going to sell us a puppet? What are we going to do with a puppet? Make a YouTube channel out of it? Yeah, do puppet videos? Who likes even playing with puppets? Yeah, who likes playing with puppets? And using them for videos? Listen, I'll give you this puppet for $20. Dollars. $20 with an extra zero. $20? $20? It's a good price, yeah. $20. Wait, Sharky, I think you're missing the bigger picture here. He said $20 with an extra zero. That's $200. We can't, we don't have $200. Yeah, you think we have money like that? Look at us. Yep, I can definitely tell y'all two are a bunch of broke boys. Listen, this puppet is very special. It will keep you busy all day long. But it's a little bit too black for my liking. Hey, black is the new white. That doesn't even make any sense. Yeah, that does make no relative sense. Listen, I'm just trying to make sense here as much as I can. And I really want to get this puppet off my hands. It's driving me crazy. Where did you even get it from? Yeah, did you get it from Amazon or something? No, I got it from this abandoned puppet factory. I'm not sure. It was just laying there, so I just snatched it. Oh. He stole that shit. Uh, fine, we'll figure out a way to get $200. Just stay here and we'll be back. Alright. Alright, Jeffrey, I guess we're going to buy the puppet, but we don't have $200. Mark has $200. Oh, yeah, because he works with that Fortnite company. He needs to quit. Yeah, he definitely does. I finally have enough money to pay off heat and power this month. This is going to be the best month ever. Yep. Yeah, Mark. But, Mark, I got a question. What is it, bro? Sarah, why do you never satisfy me in bed? What the hell are you talking about? Why are you going on about this? Like, you never satisfy me. When was the last time I satisfied you? A week ago? Yeah, I satisfy you. I'm not sure what you're talking about. Listen, your two inches are really not enough. And besides, the last time you satisfy me is when you start taking Viagra. I should slap the shit out of you for that. What the hell were those two goofballs talking about? I mean, adult conversations are crazy. I'm just gonna take this money to 
sneak on out of here. So yeah, that is the reason why I'm never taking Viagra ever again. Whatever, Mark. What the hell? What happened to my money? What are you talking about? My money, my $200 that I was supposed to pay in the poor is not here anymore. Just like how your penis is going to disappear after you get more fatter and fatter. I swear I'm about to get a divorce on you. No, I'm being like dead serious. It's gone. <sighs> like I gotta find it. I gotta find it. <sighs> Alright kids, let's make this quick. So y'all guys got my money? Yeah, we got your money. Alright, thanks. Have fun with the puppet. Goofies. Uh, that was kind of weird the way he just called us Goofies. But everybody calls us Goofies. Yep. Alright. So, like, what are we going to do with this puppet? I'm not sure. Just, you know, make some YouTube channel about it. You know, get a couple views on it. And hopefully blow up one day, you know? Yeah, that's what I'm planning. Yeah, that's what I'm planning, too. All right. But, yeah, I'm feeling a little bit tired, Jeffrey. Yeah, it's almost our bedtime. Yeah, so you just like gonna go ahead and go to sleep. Yeah, I'm getting tired as hell. Oh! oh my god, I gotta stop having these wet dreams. They're getting too intense. Oh shoot, the, the puppet's gone. <clears throat> that looks like a situation. Oh, Sharky, what the hell did you wake me up for? Did you have another wet dream? No. Maybe. No. Listen, Jeffrey, I just want to tell you something. Uh, so, like, the, the puppet's gone. Where did the puppet go? I'm not sure. Maybe Mark took it out because he thought we were too old for puppets. I mean, we are too old for puppets. But what if we're puppets? I'm not going to think about that right now. What do you think it could be? I'm not sure. Let's call out for Mark and Sarah and just ask them where it is. All right. Mark! Sarah! Mark! Hey, I just need to wake them up a little bit louder. Wow, that usually wake them up all the time. What the hell is happening? I'm not sure. It's trying to get a little bit weird. Yeah. Mark? Sarah? What? Am I tripping? Mark? Okay, there's something wrong. What the hell? Why is our door opening? Uh, I'm starting to get scared. There is no fucking way. Sharky, please don't tell me that was that was the the puppet. The hell? How is he moving? And did he get bigger? I'm not sure. You should go check it out. I'm not acting like some typical white woman in a horror movie. How about you go take it out, you non-black person? Fine, Sharky, maybe I will act like a stereotypical white person in a horror movie. I'll show this bitch what's up. Never mind, fuck that. So, since Marcus said, what even happened to Marcus here? I'm not sure. Do you think the puppet killed him? There is no way. Marcus here, they're too strong for that. 
Sarah is literally a whole white woman kind of thing. No, she's a blonde. And Marcus says some lazy, probably a crackhead. Yup, they're probably dead by now. So we gotta figure out a way to defend for ourselves. What if you just turn into that shark power of yours? For the last time, Jeffrey, it only comes over anger. But you said it comes over scaredness. I mean, I'm not that scared so far. I'm just going to transform automatically. I'm not sure. Come on, think of it. I gotta have a good idea. Sharky, the way you sat me in front of the doorway, I don't like where this is going at all. Listen, Jeffy, my full plan here is when the monster comes in, you're going to be the bait. And when he comes in, I'm going to stop him from eating you. I'm going to tell him that I'm going to make a deal with him. If we sacrifice someone, then he has to leave us alone. And who are we going to sacrifice? I already had that planned out perfectly. <clears throat> oh, I forgot. That thing is a whole ass black wolf. Whoa, 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 you black wolf puppet thing. Listen, before you really kill my brother, I want to make an offering with you. If I sacrifice someone to you, me personally, you have to leave us alone. And it'll be the best meal ever, I promise you that. Will you leave us alone and we'll give you a good snack in return? Shit, I can actually go for something to eat right now. But you can talk. Yeah, I can talk. I've been at abandoned puppet factory for so long. I forgot how to even eat. Or was when was the last good meal I had. Yeah, I can go for something to eat. Alright, serve me up whoever you're going to serve me up. I not only broke into this family's house and robbed them for some cursed doll for like $200, I finally get to sit down and watch and relax and, and you know, watch some TV on someone else's couch. This is great. Wait, what the? There is no way. Uh, all right, chill out now. Chill out. <laughs> Well, it ends well, whatever the hell. I'm just gonna lock the door and now I'm in. Jeffrey, you have our freedom back again. Nothing to worry about. But I still wonder what happened to Mark and Sarah. Oh, I forgot they were going on vacation and they, they told us this yesterday. Man, I'm so stupid.